Hello, everyone. The Rogue Inquisitor here, and we've got a doozy. I have returned to the drama world of YouTube, unfortunately. And uh, the person we're going to be looking at today is actually someone who has been causing quite a stir among uh, the YouTube community, the gaming community specifically, after he did a nasty take on... Uh, Elden Ring. This individual is known as Quantum TV. And, um, well, let's be honest. He, he, he calls himself the number one brand in honesty. And to be perfectly honest, I can't really s see that as <laughs> after the things I've seen. Uh, honesty is the last thing you're going to think of when you hear about this guy. So, so what has he been up to? Well, Quantum TV has been recently in a bunch of battles with other YouTubers, most of which um, his video, many of the videos that he's uh, made are now gone and, well, not... I guess pr they're either private or he deleted them. But essentially, all of the videos, most of the videos pertaining to back and forth between him and other YouTubers have been removed. He's claiming he was hacked for really nasty things that he said in the past. He's There's a couple of videos that are still up and, up and about. Why, I don't know, because they're not doing him any favors. But uh, the act man has recently... Uh, Posted a video about a 30 minute video copyright abuse on YouTube featuring Quantum TV. Apparently, he's been copyright or threatening to copyright claim other YouTubers. Yeah, this is apparently something that's been going on for quite a while. And uh, in the last couple of weeks, it's been. It's been coming to a head. The eye of the storm, so to speak. So we're going to take a quick look at his newest video that he's released, and it's called Quantum TV is Under Attack by the Great Value Avengers. Oh my goodness. So here's the video right here. We're going to take a quick look and just see what he says. And just so you know, Quantum, I am uh, not, I am not going to be posting everything in your video i'm not going to be just i'm not going to be doing just the whole well let's watch his video and then say stuff because of course that wouldn't be quite as transformative as it should be no we're actually going to take a detailed look at what's going on here what he says so what what's how does he open his video here oh, by the way i think it's worth noticing i think it's worth noting here for those who aren't aware, every single video he makes, even the bad ones, and I mean really bad, every single video he makes has a fundraiser tag on it. This dude is attempting to try and make money even off of these drama videos, which quite honestly is the worst thing he could be doing, especially since these drama videos are the very thing that's probably going to have his channel get deleted. But... Let's begin. For, hold on. First of all, I got to make sure you guys can hear it. <laughs> okay. So let's take a quick look and see what some of the stuff he says here. So as of late, a lot of fake accounts have been making a lot of uh, posts as me, and I predict it'll get worse. Now, these accounts are being taken as factually words that I've said and statements that I've said. Okay, so he's saying that... So, there was a live stream between Quantum TV uh, and if Act Man and a few other people. And they were... Um, in the live stream, there was people under the name of Quantum TV making troll comments. The thing is... <laughs> and this is funny... Quantum TV is trying to pass off these trolls as the people who hacked him. It's not going to fly. 
it's not gonna fly like he's gonna point at the at the troll comments in that live stream and say yeah people like this hacked my twitter people like this made those nasty comments comments that he still doesn't disavow he made one video where he said in one sentence that oh well i disavow that all things that they said but you kept it up like you didn't delete those things you you kept them on your social media i don't care how incompetent you claim to be with social media it's a thing that grandmas can figure out surely a man of your age can figure out how to operate a facebook page a twitter page something that old seniors are capable of doing you're not capable of doing come on man like the most technically illiterate people on this planet are doing things you should be able to do but let's continue looking at this and see what else he has to say so I'm just kind of here to let you guys know that people that hate me will absolutely say whatever they want. And again, it probably is going to get worse because nobody cares about checking where this stuff came from. And so as a result, I've been getting a barrage of hate comments. Here's the problem, Quantum TV. It's you seem to have it all wrong. It's not it's not that nobody cares where all this stuff is coming from. It's because they care that you're in this much trouble. You're the one who doesn't really care where stuff comes from. Otherwise, you would have done something about it. It's because people care that there is as much shit under the rug as there is now. And that stuff has seeped through and it's stinking up the room. People are, fig are investigating to find out about it. They're finding the skeletons. They're finding the wallets. They're finding the receipts. You know, they're, they're finding out what exactly is... Um, raising this stink and it's a long-standing stink and it's one that needs to be rectified act man made a wonderful video again go check out that guy um check out mischief as well because he's a he's the one who who um with 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 which this whole beef started quantum tv actually took down or sorry he he threatened to copyright strike mischief's video which is actually against terms of service, by the way. But uh, yeah, so he threatened uh, Mischief. Mischief took it down to avoid drama. And Quantum started going on a, a tirade about how he was right. Everyone else is wrong. But no, uh, it's, it's like I said, it's specifically because people care. It's because, you know, we, we care about accuracy that you're in as much shit as you're in Quantum. Let's take a look from of course public opinion based off of these people that seem to want to run with fake comments like i said we've already talked about the fake comments in the live stream like those were addressed they addressed the fake comments now the people who are behind this know full and well what they're doing and they know the kind of damage that it can cause when you cause rumors they even know and have been made aware that there are quantum TV in person. Okay, hold on. Cause rumors? None of these guys cause rumors, Quantum. They're just reacting to things that you did. Everything that's happening is a result of things you did. They didn't create any rumors. This is all stuff that you yourself have done. And apparently thought you were in the right, but, you know. Personators, as they pretend like it's not happening and everything I'm showing is fake, I wasn't hacked and all that stuff that they claim, they know impersonations are out there. I Again, impersonations and what... <sighs> impersonations and hacks are two very different things. Someone can create an account and impersonate you that's not the same as getting hacked. Okay, you're trying to put the two together. That's that's not how it works. Somebody can create an account trying to impersonate me, but unless they have the same, exact same content as I do, like unless they're able to upload my content word for word, uh, video for video on the same day, like people are going to know who's who's the real person. 
<clears throat> anyway, um, let's continue. I want you to pay attention to how easily they fall for all of the fake correspondence. It's not hard to see that this is somebody trolling, but this is how it happens. This is how rumors become fact in the minds of the uneducated. There is nothing uneducated about <laughs> about these people, Quantum. The fact is, is that you are a nasty person. You've done bad things in the past. You've said horrible things in the past. And um, yeah, they are more likely to believe one of these Smurf accounts with the comments they say because of your history. It's not that, you know, this is not some dismissive thing. Like they were, they were quick to think it was you because you have a history of being a shitty person. Now, someone pointed out to them that it was a fake, that it was a fake account in the live stream. And so, yeah, they, they actually said, okay, that's fine. They, they acknowledged it. But you seem to want to push, point out that, um, oh, well, look how easily they were, you know, deceived or something like that. It's, it's not that they were easily deceived, Quantum. It's that you're very hard to prove innocent. Anyway, let's continue. You're bullying you me say? because you're, I'm black. There ain't no way, Jeez. <laughs> no Wait, one I didn't about see that. Race. Yeah, I'll put it on. Oh, show. no. Oh, no. He, <sighs> dude. <laughs> no. When you have no <laughs> other options. I, I fucking predicted it like a couple weeks ago. He was going to play. So... <sighs> In a few seconds, they actually talk about how like it's a it's a fake account. Ran out of points to make, so he just went. Oh my boy! You might have the race card. <laughs> All right. Oh well. If it's a fake account, I'll ban him. I'll double check that. So there you go. They double checked. These aren't some guys that are just going to take like every nasty thing at face value. They double check their facts. Do you, Quantum? I don't think so. Oh boy. There's some there's a lot of dirt. I've been watching this since I can't say I've been watching it since the beginning. I found out about it probably a a little after it happened. But I've been, f but I've been following the drama, and it goes pretty deep. So anyway, we're gonna keep on going here. Yeah, double check that. Yeah, I'll ban that account over. Oh, okay. See, like they're even willing to ban. They're, they're banning the account. They're banning these doubles because acknowledging their that they're doubles. They're banning them to filter out their bullshit. So yeah. that wasn't was. That's that was bad. not him. Notice how easily fooled they are. One side of my face and my name, and that's all it takes. Yeah, like I said, because you're not someone who can who can easily, you know, claim innocence in all this. It's like you you created this uphill battle for yourself, and you know, pointing at some rando out there who decides to try and impersonate you and say look they're the kind of people that do this they're the reason i'm in trouble no you're the reason you're in trouble the randoms are just making it harder for you to prove you're like you're not you're not innocent the, the randoms are just making your life worse but it's easy because you are a bad person man i don't know I, w I wonder sometimes how a person can honestly think that they're in the right when they say the things you've said and then turn around and say, well, look at all of these trolls and stuff who say bad things in my name. Like I said, it's easy to make you look bad when you already made yourself look bad to begin with. Anyway, I'm not going to post too much more of this. This is really just um, him kind of going over some, some videos. Uh, this is basically a response to the Act Man's video. And it's, and it's relatively short. 
Jesus Christ, how many people are going to make? We can't, dude, if you just joined the call. <laughs> like, exactly. Why would anyone want to impersonate him? <laughs> Why would anyone want to impersonate this guy? Constantly getting text messages all the time about stuff like this kind of content being posted on things like Reddit. So, again, I have no idea what the hell's going on. Those as you guys about it, that doesn't do anything. Always click to see if it's me. And then, more importantly, always make sure that I'm not currently hacked because that's a th look <sighs> okay so about this hacked thing i for one don't believe that it's real i don't think you were hacked i don't think you were hacked okay the smurf accounts the fake accounts the people trying to impersonate you i'll acknowledge those as being real but this whole thing about you being hacked i'm calling bullshit everyone has called bullshit on this the only one who hasn't acknowledged that, you know, it's probably time to stop the facade is you. <sighs> it's... What is it the X-Men said? Uh, narcissistic personality disorder. There is no cure. Dude, you, Quantum, you've got it in spades. The only the only route I see this going is with you, your channel going down. And um, I'm expecting to see that happen within the next month. If you I swear, if you actually try to take Ackman to court over his content on you, it's going to end poorly. Same if you try to take it over here, down over here as well. Like this is fair use. I'm transformative content i am you know i'm a little more raw with how i make videos but you're not gonna have a you're not gonna have a a prayer of winning any legal battles against anyone here on youtube it's sad that you've actually come this far in this rabbit hole Ugh. i cannot wait to see how it I cannot wait to see how it ends honestly also I'm sorry if, if throughout the video I'm a little loud I'm still trying to figure out how to properly set up my mic anyway that's all I have to say uh this actually went on longer than I ever hoped it would so sorry about that guys but uh yeah I'm gonna start trying to make videos um, hopefully not all drama videos. I want to try and do something productive. And to that end, I'm going to be sprucing up the room uh, far better. I got stuff that I want to put, put up on the wall here to cover this mess. Because that's, you know, long overdue. Anyway, this is the Rogue Inquisitor. Signing off. Peace out, guys, and have fun.